Good morning, America. We're going to start the Ruby channel. This is Ruby. Sits. Got my phone number on her collar. Probably don't want to put that out there. We've had Ruby for about 11 months. She was a rescue. She, hey. Ruby likes to run on a treadmill. Ha, huh, Ru. Time for Ruby's morning run. So we'll, we'll make the introductions later. And we do have to give Ruby a treat. It's like, how do you, how do you teach your dog to run on a treadmill? Well, copious amounts of treats. There is no secret to it. Ha, huh, Ru, Ru. But to that point, Ruby has traditionally done um, two to two and a half miles every morning, except for Sunday. We do give her Sunday off. A um, couple reasons for this. Um, due to her light colored skin, I live here in Tucson, Arizona. And due to her uh, light colored skin, um, she, they're, they're very prone to skin cancer. So my vet uh, was definitely warning of that, where she can wear clothes, which is kind of goofy. I'm not one of those that dresses my dog up. Uh, sunscreen, an option. But um, Ruby, <laughs> hey, good girl, Ruru. Yes, you are. I'm going to kneel down here while we're recording. Such a good girl, Ruru. Um, Ruby is the, I got her a month after losing Abby, my Doberman, I came home, she was barely alive, we'll going to that later, but got Ruby about a month later, good friend of mine, volunteers at the main society, said you gotta meet this dog, she was uh, picked up by uh, animal control, pregnant, so they sent her to the Humane Society. Main Society sent her to a foster home to uh, for her, you know, while she was in uh, while she was pregnant and had her litter and at that six seven weeks whatever the time was uh, they went back to the Main Society with all of her puppies at uh, one of the local malls and her puppies got adopted out and she needed her forever home so my friend called me I really wasn't ready uh, for another dog but she convinced me to run down there I did met Ruby. Wasn't really interested in me at the time, but uh, for some reason I thought, yeah, there's something special about this dog, and uh, I picked her up that evening. Actually, my friend picked her up from the main setting, brought her in for me, and she has been, uh, she's been a, a godson. She's a great pup. Anyway, oh, and first dog that's ever been allowed on my furniture. I was a little irritated when I first got her because I've never been one to allow dogs on furniture, but I was upset at the foster mom for allowing this, but you know, she she did that, and I realized pretty quickly I wasn't going to break her of that habit, so I just kind of allowed it, so that's why the sunscreen was um, not an option for me because she's on my furniture and whatnot, and I don't want sunscreen on everything. So, years ago, I've always had Rottweilers and Dobies. I trained one of my Rottweilers to run on a treadmill about 15, 16 years ago. And thought, you know, I'll try to do this with Ruby. You know, get her exercise. She's not out uh, in the sun. But she gets her, uh, her exercise. Um, and uh, so, yeah, I went to Played Against Sports. Picked up a $150 treadmill. And... A week of, yeah, you know, and she took to this actually very, very quickly and easily. So, so the vet, surprisingly, uh, our visit last week said she's about five pounds overweight. Eh, I don't think so, but so she said bump her up to about three miles a day. So that's what we do. So, really, um, uh, every morning while I'm getting ready, I, you know, Ruby hops up on the treadmill, does her thing, I go take my shower and um, come back and she's, you know, by that time, you know, two, two and a half miles um, and do a little cool down walk and then uh, she's done. But that gets her exercise and we still walk outside usually real early in the morning or late in the evening and, you know, where the sun's kind of going down so her exposure is limited and she has access to outside through doggy door but, you know, I try to keep her inside whenever possible. So she's had uh, a long enough warm up walk 
so we're gonna bump her up about four miles an hour here. Oh, such a good girl, Ruru. Such a good girl. We're at 3.3 miles an hour. Good girl, Ruru. And she'll do this for about 30, 35 minutes. And I'll come back and um, come back and knock her down to about 2.5 just to cool down. And that is her exercise. Such a good girl, puppy.